Hi, this is Paolo from DMB Academy and in this video I'm going to be showing you how to create jump up basses like the ones in the track Millionaire by Anix. So this is the original. And this is my recreation. But before we get started with the video, I gotta tell you that only 50% of people who watch your videos are actually subscribed. So if you end up liking one of our videos and find it useful, consider subscribing. It's free and it helps us build more free content for you in the future. Also, if you wanna get access to this preset and the project files, you can become a member of the DMB Academy preset pass. The link is in the description below. So with that being said, let's get into the video. Okay, so here I am with the initialized patch and the first thing we're gonna do is to create a sub. So for that, we're gonna load a sine wave, bring it to the sub frequencies, add noise, and then distort these two together. And then use an EQ to remove unnecessary frequencies in the low mid. And this is gonna be the sub patch. So if we mix it with the other patch, We get that. So now let's jump into the next patch. Okay, so here's another init serum. And we're gonna load one more sine wave. We're gonna do the same for oscillator B, like this. Then we're also gonna activate the sub and the noise. And to get those high frequencies, we're going to add FM from B. And then we're gonna boost the octave of oscillator B. And to get that interesting harmony, we're gonna increase the semitones by seven. Then we're gonna play with the mix of different layers. And then we're gonna head over to the effects section and add distortion. Next, we're going to turn on the compressor and set it on multiband. We're going to add an EQ and we're going to use this EQ as a filter. So let's set it to a low pass. Then we're going to map an LFO into the frequency. We're going to bring the Q a bit lower and we're going to create a different shape with this LFO. First, we're going to make it slower and then make a falling shape with it like this. Set it on envelope so it triggers with every note, and then let's add a lot of reverb. You can also add a bell with the EQ. Depending on the tonality that you want in your sound. And to experiment with this patch, you can go back and change the FM amount. You can change the octave of oscillator B. You can mix the different layers, for example, bring oscillator B lower and oscillator A higher. And just fine tune whatever sounds good in your track. So let's hear the final result. Cool. So that is going to be it for the sound and also for this video. If you liked it, make sure you get subscribed to the channel. Hit the notification bell to not miss any for future videos. Once again, if you want to get access to the preset and the project file, you can become a member of the DMB Academy preset pass. The link is in the description below. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you have a nice day and I'll see you in the next video. Bye bye.